Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and today we are fighting France as Byzantium here in Europa Universalis 4. That is our war. This is the second big war with France, and it's going to be a big one, that's for sure. Currently got some big battles going on here in Treviso and Mantua. Mantua is about to turn against us, uh, so hopefully Treviso can finish up quickly here. Not sure if they can, though. The French morale is sticking around too long. Oh, we won in Mantua. Oh, perfect. We won in Mantua. I approve. Now we can go fight in Cremona. Let's do that. Actually, let's just wait till the end of the month. Let's get our morale back. Yeah, stay there for now. Oh, we found another French army. Just a little wandering stack of seven. Lol. Okay, we killed them. And he wants to come play in in Mantua. That's fine. I would prefer to do Mantua than Modena. No, it's all planes. Yeah, it's just, it's just all planes down here. It's just all flat. You guys are forced marching around this battle. That's fine. This battle's going great for us. They're sieging Vienna. Okay. This is going to be tough. They're arriving before the end of the month, so we're not going to get any morale bonus. But this one should finish up, and then we can go help out. Yeah, this one's not going to be good for us. At least not at the beginning. Actually, he's taking heavy losses there. Wow, are we killing him. Rolling nines helps. Okay, yeah, we won the Battle of Trevizo. So we're a two and a half war score. Uh, we lost 6,000 guys, and they lost about 10,000. Cool. It's actually a very low number of losses for a battle that large, but I guess it's hard to fight in the mountains like that. Okay, you guys don't need Forced March anymore. Why don't you head to Brescia? Oh, they got Brescia back? Really? Uh, you guys go to Ferrara. And turn that off. And you can go help this battle. Don't need Forced March. Oh, I can't turn it off. Stupid Forced March bug. Here, I'll turn it on for you. And then turn it back off. And then we can do that. Yep. Kind of weird how that works, or doesn't work. Whatever you want to say. And I'm surprised we're going to win this battle even without any help. There we go. More War Score. I think we've maxed out our War Score. Yeah, we've already maxed out the war score, so now we have to finish Salento, and then once we finish Salento, we're going to have war score ticking in our favor. Good. Uh, in the meantime, you guys can just, I don't know, heal up, whatever you want to do. Go to Romagna, you need a heal. Uh, you can go to Ferrara, that's, well, no, stay, I don't know. Any, any, even though we've conquered these places, you still take attrition here because they're full defensive. And it doesn't make any sense. If, even if you're full defensive, you shouldn't take attrition once it's been conquered like that. Hmm. I don't want to split up too much. Ah, here we go. Yeah, I didn't see him here in Parma. Do we have access to you? No. We need access in Switzerland. Oh, don't have a diplomat. Um, we'll be done in, in Denmark real soon. All right, Brescia. Wow, I don't know how they got Brescia back that quickly. But yeah, we got a lot of armies here. We got more stacks coming up. Why don't you guys come over here to Lombardia? And you guys can go to... Do, 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 do. We need access in Savoy as well. We just need access so we can walk back and forth quickly like France does. Go to Lyons for now. Denmark. 
There we go. You want to go south, eh? I'd rather you didn't. I'd rather you didn't do that. Rolling zeros, that's not good. Come on, don't roll zeros. Now that's probably the last big battle we're going to have for a little bit here. So I'm going to go ahead and upgrade our units. <sighs> square or impulse? Mm, they're both good. Let's go for squares. Ooh. Yeah, get the extra fire. There we go. Units are done. You're kidding me, right? No, no, we'll be fine. It's the end of the month. Yeah, he thought better of that real quick. <laughs> I only have two generals. Yeah, we need more generals. Oh, wow. 626. Six. Yeah, thank you. Okay, we got one. Go to the war goal. Good. Finally have a piece of Italy. Well, southern Italy. Oh shit, we're taking attrition up there? Oh my goodness. Uh, Swing around to there, I guess. Okay. Tech up our Diplo. Uh, we might need the Diplo for the peace deal, so let's not bother with that just yet. Let's advance. Look at that. Okay, and Kona, very good. Uh, um, come out, out in Messina, that one's taking forever. Fell. Uh, go Calabria. Looks like he really wants to play. Has he teched up yet? No, he's still at tech 28, so we have way better units than him. Well, sort sort of better, right? They're better. Max relations with perm, okay. That's pretty much maxed. That could be better. Don't send an insult, are you crazy? Oh, the stupid rebels stopped. God damn it. Fucking rebels didn't do their job, did they?
Alright, he's bringing 65 guys or something like that. No, more than that. He's bringing 70, 73 guys. Alright. Oh, now you don't want to. Oh, yeah, you do. Oh, he's got even more guys. Okay. Royal Rumble in Lombardy. Drop a siege, bro. Shit's about to get real. I'm not even sure we're going to need more than just these two. These two armies might be fine. There we go. It's picked off. 90 versus 90. He's in the mountains. That's good for us. He's got a 5-6 general. Wow, that's a good general. Jesus. Now we'll take the guy with no leader. Go help. We don't need more than that, really. Siege all the things. Lombard Patriots, that's fine. Let's go smash them and come back. Rolling ones is not helping here. Come on. Not really doing much damage to each other. This is like throwing spitballs or something. Now oh, let's go so discontent. Volt risk goes up by one and stability cost goes up. Does he have negative stability? No, he has plus two stability. Well, that seems like a dumb fun. It's only plus one national vote risk. That's it? Wow. Uh, he does have some more exhaustion, though. So that increases his revolt risk. And I guess it can't hurt to sow discontent. Good little battle for us, that's for sure. Ah, Tuscan is integrated. Fantastic, let's convert it. And, yep, free core. I approve. Hey, we got some boats out of it. Thank you, Tuscany, for your boats. I think we're over our boat limit. Yeah, we're still over the boat limit. Oh, well. Whatever. And we now have the war goal. Nice. That's going to be a huge improvement on our, uh, on our war score. Why don't you guys start collecting up here? Group up everybody from Italy into um, I can't believe this battle is still ongoing. Long battle is long. Uh, Bohemia. I bet he wants an alliance back. I bet Denmark wants an alliance back. No? I have to wait till the war is over. Oh, we can get Smolensk. Go ahead and do them. Florence fell. Go to Modena. Can we get Kazan as well? Yeah, alright. So they don't care that we're at war. The war's far enough away, they're like, whatever. The entirety of France's army. 
They don't seem to have anything else. I mean, they have 150 guys, but there's 100 of them right there. And we won. We got three. We didn't, The war score, it says you get it, but you don't actually get that war score. Okay, his losses are about 17,000. Our losses were 2,000. Works for me. But now he's going to retreat to, you know, who knows where. It doesn't really matter, I guess. He's basically going to retreat too far away to, to matter at all. Let's go ahead and get a new vassal. Uh, we should probably get these guys a little spread out. Huh? Okay, start the invasion. And become my bitch. Yay, free bitch. Should also get Kazan. And we can integrate Perm after this war. Stupid Brescia. Here, let's get you out. problem here is if we get too spread out, he might uh, smash one of us individually, right? And I'd prefer not to do that. I'd prefer to have, you know, a fun advance into France. Advance into France for fun. I'll see how it goes. Does he have any manpower? He's got 11k. He's pretty trashed. France wants peace. There you go. Seat Salento, Ancona, Abruzzi to Florence. But I don't want 56 aggressive expansion. And what this tells me is you are going to have increasing war exhaustion and you're going to start having that call for peace flag thing will bother, which is great. Hopefully he'll have some rebels and shit too. That'd be nice. Uh, Sweden wants access. Nope. Law. We have access. We'll be your friends. Nope. I don't want friends. I want to beat you in the skull with my hammer. Hmm, Smolensk, the newest vassal. The best vassal. Always gotta love the new one more than the rest, right? Just like when you have babies. You can't love the old babies anymore. It's just not possible. Mr. 44 Troops, let's go to French Comte. Castile wants access. Sure. Uh, Castile should start winning battles over here. Oh, Britain is invading. <laughs> Britain is invading France. I love it. What is France at war with? Let's take a look. You ready? France at war with that. Oh, man. It's not a good day to be a Frenchman. Not a good day to be, especially if you're in the army. You'll be like, oh, God, no. Why did I choose this line of work? So what can we do? Can we make them spit out Naples? That's really my goal. Yeah, only 54%. And they will. Look at that. They will. 
I approve. I wish we could make them cancel their uh, personal union down here, but that's not going to happen. But they will spit out Naples. And it should get cheaper. It's currently 50... It's currently 54% cost to spit out Naples. And then all we have to do is wait five years and then go to war with Naples. Take out as much of them as we want. Uh, and Naples would be Catholic, right? Yeah, all of their land is Catholic. France never converted any of them. Uh, yeah. And we can make them give this back to Aragon. That's probably a good idea. So you know what? Why don't we do this now? And then we can come back and do more war later. Return that to Aragon. You will. Good guy, France. Returning cores to Aragon. Want to return anything else to anyone? Nope. Nope. Alright, well that's fine. We'll just peace out. It's all good in the hood. Alright, so there is the peace deal. Naples is free. And they're like, yay! Except they are Catholic. Good. That means we have cleansing of heresy on them. Alright, you motherfuckers, come here. They have no allies, no nothing. But I, I assume we have a truce, because we just made them we just made them get vomited out. Group up over there. Uh, we'll take all of our armies home to Constantinople. Derp. Derp derp. Uh, why don't you go through her? I'm gonna have to cancel my access in Bohemia. Uh, no, it should be fine. Just go like you normally would, and we'll see if anyone gets stuck along the way. So let's do that. And then we can vassalize Kazan. We should start integrating everyone. Ukraine likes us for a change. Wow. But yeah, let's start integrating Styria. Ooh, we can't. We're actually pretty close, though. Portugal give core Muskegee to USA. Oh, USA exists. Hey, there you go. All right. Uh huh. Uh huh. Mm hmm. And null treaties with Bohemia, France, and Aragon. So you lost your alliance with France. Okay, good. And that means France is still at war with Britain and Castile. That is fantastic. That is just fantastic. I bet we could get our alliances back as well. Lovely. Yep, there's Denmark with the alliance. Sounds good to me, bro. It looks like they put most of their vassals... No, I was going to say it looks like they put most of their rebels down, but no, no way. Sweden is back with a vengeance. Look at this. Yeah. Denmark, you suck. The AI is terrible at putting down rebels. Okay, how close are we on Barar? Pretty far away. Damn it. I don't think I don't think we're ever gonna get Barar before the end of the game. We can do Styria pretty soon here. Not yet. Uh yeah, get out of France. Prove relation in Kazan. That's pretty much done, I think. Might as well max it out, though. You don't need that. Everyone just go do your thing. We'll keep that army in Roma. Uh, yep. Keep you guys in Romagna. Everybody's still rolling out. Good. Our diplomat's back from France. So we can't declare war on Naples right away, and that's unfortunate because it's going to say we have a truce. It's an invisible truce. Basically, it only shows France, but that's, that truce applies to us as well. So hopefully they won't get any alliances or anything because that would really suck. Uh, but I would love to just come in here and just wreck, wreck them. And just be like, yeah, yeah, you guys suck. All right, let's get our trade ships out doing trade things. You can patrol... I don't know. 
Ragusa. Whatever. Patrol whatever the hell you want. Okay, you can patrol Constantinople Derp. You don't have any trade ships. You can patrol... Uh, I don't know. Crimea? Go for it. And that's it. And the non-trade ships go join up with my non-trade ships. And trade ships go back to doing your thing. Patrol the Gulf of Aden. Patrol um, Basra, sure. Split in half. Patrol Indus. Indus, Indus, Indus. There you go. And you can do this node, whatever it's called. Ceylon. There you go. Have fun. That'll bring in a little more income. Can we do any special buildings? No unique buildings, damn it. Alright. That went well. I approve of that war. Now let's see if we can't get relations back. Actually, let's get this alliance first. Let's get these guys vassalized. Oh, put speed back up. They're offering a marriage. That's great. Let's start integrating Polotsk. Vassalize Kazan. Great. So the current Roman or the current Byzantine Empire looks like this. That's fantastic. We're gonna have a weird snaky thing over here. That's fine. I wish. You guys, uh, I mean, he would accept vassalization, but we can't get relations high enough. Uh, you know what? We'll try. With that eased tension penalty, we might actually be able to get there. Enemy of enemy would be Livonian Order. Oh, we have Poland, so we already have enemy of enemy. Yeah, let's try. It can't hurt, right? That eased tension thing gives us plus 60. So we're on a timer. If we can get relations fast enough, we might be able to uh, vassalize them. That'd be cool. They would take an alliance and a marriage, too. Good. Okay, why don't you guys go to Burgas instead? Go that way. And you guys go to Adrianople. I don't know. Just don't take too much attrition, please. Okay, you guys got stuck. No, you're not stuck. Keep rolling. Don't get stuck on my account. Uh, improve relation in Palazzo. You don't need to. Styria. Uh can't do much there, can we? We're really close, though. We're really, really close with Styria. Send him a small gift. Grand Captain died. Damn it. Let's keep going with plus threes. I want to maximize the amount of tech we can get before the end of the game. We have so much money. Just plus three everything. So close. Uh, Krako. We could do them. Let's go ahead and do them. Why not? Why wait? Right? Why wait? Need a small gift with everyone. They're just so far gone. Because we can't marry him. It's just such a pain in the dick. And we can't do enemy of enemy. You can't marry him and you can't do enemy of enemy. It's just like, wow. I'm going to start integrating you, right? Yeah. Start perm. Okay, that's a big enough stack. Go to Psycheon. You guys can group up. Split in half, sends them across the sea. Go to Burgas instead. Wow, that's a lot of motherfucking units. That is a lot of units. Wow. We're over our limit by one. Can we get under the limit? Where are we at? Well, 
Bohemia, that's the one that's kind of dragging us down. But I do want to keep that alliance. So we'll see if we can't get relations up over here. We can claim the throne? Really? Really? Oh man, that'd be hilarious. Right, it would piss off all of our vassals though. Okay, you're not ready. It's going to be two years before we can do that. Ah, oh, lose stability or lose stability? Do I want to lose two or just one? We'll lose one. God damn it. At least it's cheap to get our stability back up. But still, what a waste, you know? What a waste. Are you still building ships? Stop building ships, my goodness. Patrol, constant derp. Constant derp. Constant derp. In fact, that's a great name. Constant derp. Perfect. I approve of that name. Free diplomat. Ah, goodness. Might as well try. Hundred and nineteen. Yeah, we can get there. We can do it. It's gonna be tough. Keep an eye on that. This one is a little bit off. Converted Romania, good. You know what, we do need to end here. It's been 32 minutes. I'm so glad we got out of that war. Uh, when does this truce end? He's got four more years. And he has an alliance with Switzerland. Okay, fine. See you guys next time. Have a good day.